There's been a giant debate about whether the daiquiri is a drink for a lady or a drink for a lady's man. <laughs> well, it's 2019, so I'm not answering that question. Let me see if this helps. Daiquiri good. Banana daiquiri, strawberry daiquiri, mango daiquiri. Bad, bad, bad. Now that we've cleared that up, let's get started. Hey everyone, I'm Bo Robinson. This is Bar School. I didn't know much about Cuba when I was growing up. Knew I wasn't allowed to go there. Knew about their cigars and some dictator named Fidel. But I didn't know that Cuba was at the center of cocktailing with the oldest recorded recipe to date, El Drake. Which I must have missed when I previously mentioned my mojito episode. The daiquiri is another alcoholic beverage that gets to call Cuba home. It was created in 1896 by an American engineer named Jennings Cox who ran out of gin trying to entertain guests. Cox thought rum was going to be too powerful, so he added a little bit of lemon, sugar, and mineral water, creating a punch for everyone to share. He even has his own recipe card to prove it. During this time, we would have called this a rum sour, but Cox didn't think that name was appropriate for his new creation, so he decided to name it after the beachhead that brought him to Cuba, Daiquiri. To be fair, the combination of water, rum, citrus, and sugar was already pretty well known with Cuban natives. They even had a general recipe. It was one sour, two sweet, three strong, four weak. Just if they had come up with a name. American knowledge of the daiquiri is credited to Admiral Lucius W. Johnson, who in 1909 thought it was a great idea to introduce the cocktail to the Navy and Army Club in DC, along with the University Club in Baltimore. From there, it spread, and as things spread, things change. The daiquiri went from a punch to a single serving, from being poured over crushed ice to being shaken with crushed ice. And somebody even switched out the lemon for lime. Here's how we make it today. Start out by grabbing your tins. You're gonna add ice to the tiny tin. Then add a half ounce of simple syrup, full ounce of lime juice, and two ounces of Bacardi white rum to your big tin. And that's it. Put your jigger down. We're gonna shake this cocktail. And try to smile. You don't wanna look constipated. Next, grab a coupe glass. And your double strainer. Cause so we're gonna strain this right into our coupe glass. And lastly, garnish with a lime wheel. And that's the daiquiri. Sometimes I let my insecurities get to me. Mm -mm. It's got my three favorite things. Rum, rum, and more rum. <laughs> Thank you all for tuning in. Cheers. And please drink responsibly. Thanks.